This is Ian with I Am Home Inspections. We're counting down the top 10 reasons why you need to attend your home inspection. Number 10, you have a legal obligation to mitigate your damages. Meaning, if there's some aspect of the home that you don't like after you move in, and you decide to sue somebody, the judge is going to ask you if you attend to your home inspection and observe this yourself beforehand. And if you say no, you can be equally as liable. Number nine, the California Association of Realtors Form SBSA says that you have a legal obligation to investigate the property yourself. And if you don't, you're going against the advice of your broker, which means attend your home inspection and investigate the property yourself. Number eight, my favorite. I want you to see how our inspectors sweat. I want you to see how hard they work for you. I want you to observe them going to the attic, on the roof, under the house, wherever it takes to get the best inspection for you. You should really see it for yourself. Attend your home inspection. Number seven is you can ask your inspector questions. This is a great time to ask anything you need, want to ask about the house. You're paying for the time. You might as well use it. Just please ask questions about the room the inspector's in and don't pull them into a different room. Number six, you'll much better understand your report. As much as our reports are easy to read and easy to understand, they can still be long and can feel overwhelming if you've never read one before. Attend your inspection and ask your inspector questions and you'll have a much better understanding of your report. And number five, learn where important things are. Your inspector can point out where the electrical panel is, where the wine and water shutoff is, where your gas shutoff is, and you'll have time in the house to find which light switches go to what. Attend your home inspection. Number four, California law says style and aesthetic should not be considered in your home inspection. Therefore, if the carpet in different rooms is different colors or different rooms have different kinds of flooring or different kinds of tile, or the tiles don't match from one room to another room, none of that is going to be in your home inspection. You need to come to the house and see it yourself. Number three, talk to your inspector beforehand. Let them know if you have any specific concerns. Is there something about the house you noticed ahead of time? Are you moving in with kids? No kids, seniors, anything that can influence how the inspector's looking at the house. Look, he's going to do a great job anyway, but it's always nice to know what you're thinking. Reason two, check out the neighborhood. The home inspection is only focused on the home itself. Things about the neighborhood, neighborhood noises, what's going on with the neighbors, what's going on with the general vibe of the neighborhood. None of that's going to be covered in the report because the report is only focused on the house itself. So you should attend your home inspection. Number one is you got to get a vibe of the house. Look, you probably were only in the house 15, 20 minutes before your agent said, we got to write an offer or move on. Now's your chance to spend anywhere from two, three, maybe four hours in the house and hang out in the house and just see, do you like the general vibe of the house? This is your chance to check it out. Attend your home inspection.